best of three. It was 2-1. So uh, Zero Zero Nation trying to hold on to the their, their last stand in, in the group stage. They just barely eked out against Webster's earlier today. Whew. That, that, that was a uh, that was a incredible banger. best of three, and so uh, it, it would be it would be fun to see a Sprout Zero Zero Nation again. I think I think we got Patty coming in here, so yeah, okay. let's uh, let's bring him in. All right, hello, hello, Patty, how you doing? Hello, guys, doing good. All right, awesome. First of all, congratulations on the win. You guys take the two zero and secure a playoff spot here in the Bedboom playlist. Freedom. Uh, just wanted to get your initial thoughts on kind of both of these maps. Uh, you know, obviously you stole the map pick away from Sprout on Anubis. Take us through your thoughts uh, just and kind of the conclusions you took away from the beginning. Well, actually, we didn't expect them to pick Anubis, but um, mm. we're, we're actually preparing Ancient, but uh, they picked Anubis, mm. so... And we have been practicing Anubis this week, and it's been really good in practice. So when they picked Anubis, I personally was very uh, comfortable comfortable about it. And uh, we had a really good T side, so and that and that showed in the game. It, it absolutely did. I, I mean, I was, I was singing your praises just from an uh, from a leadership perspective. It just seemed like y'all had the read the entire time of what um what what Sprout were trying to do. I mean, the the late hits towards the the B site after kind of pressuring A so often early in that half was that kind of the plan from the beginning? Find that A pressure forced them to play a bit more um, A sided and then go towards B. Mm, I don't know if it was the plan, but what we noticed when we watched the demos that they they over rotate a lot. Like they they absolutely over rotate. So like a part of the game plan was to do like fakes, and yeah, try to make them over rotate and hit them on the weak side. So yeah. Well, when you watch this one back, I think you'll see, and you probably saw during the game that that was really effective. Um, let let me ask about the CT side though on on Anubis because. Um, you guys were really taking a lot of mid-round aggression. You know, we, we saw pretty consistently Mr. would be posted outside, uh, you know, grabbing B main control. Um, what's the what's the plan there? Is, is that that consistently your all strategy? Mm, on Anubis? On mid? Uh, on, um, on B. On B? Oh. Um, well, to be honest, I don't, I don't even remember. I, I don't know. <laughs> I just think he's just playing like leg position and he's trying to find the timings. Okay, gotcha. Well, um, so talking generally about the the not just the series but the tournament in general, you guys getting into playoffs. Is there um, is there anybody that that you're hoping to play in the playoffs or that you're hoping to see? Um, to be honest, I don't know the teams that are in playoff. Um, I I just take I just take match by match. So for me, it doesn't really matter. Like. Uh, if you want to win the tournament, you have to beat everyone. So, in the end, it doesn't matter. Yeah, I mean, uh, I want to talk about Inferno a little bit. This is kind of one of your more comfortable maps in the pool. Uh, you know, playing it 25 times in the last three months. That is, a, <laughs> that's a lot of Inferno. And uh, Sprout actually gave you a bit of a tough time on your T side, which is where you do find a lot of your success. What did you think was one of the reasons why they were able to kind of stick with you guys in that first half? Uh, I think one of the biggest reasons, because uh, the, on, the, on the T side, we, we play a lot for like uh, banana control and uh, like um, we're, we're relying heavy on banana fights. But they played like a uh, kind of retake on B and they saved all their nades for like uh, late round. So it took some time to figure out how to like uh, counter their style because we're used to like like more uh, like a uh, brawl on banana. But they just played full defensive and it kind of it messed with us. Yeah. Fair enough. I mean, you guys have a little bit of a break here before you move into the playoff matches. So we'll let you, uh, you know, get some rest here. Thank you for talking with us, uh, letting us pick your brain. And again, congratulations on the victory. Thank you, guys. All right. Great to hear from Patty there. And Astralis Talent, of course, the 